What's up, witches and warlocks? Puma Fist here. The Lazy Sunday Rant is upon us again. Jesus Christ, why does the time keep going by so fucking fast? Just getting faster and faster. It's kind of depressing. And it's so great when you're a kid, everything seems like it takes forever. Once you get old, fuck, man. You literally, it's just like watching the pages fly off of the fucking calendar. Uh, like it's a fucking Harry Potter fucking magic trick or some shit. <laughs> pages just flying off. Days going by so fucking fast. Ugh, it's depressing. But what are you going to do? What are you going to do? So anyway, what are we going to talk about today? Well, there's really not a whole lot going on. Uh, I'm, I'm switching my job. I went over that previously. Uh, yeah, this motherfuckers. Getting the fuck out of there. My buddy's hooking me up. Uh, I should have some more information tomorrow. So, it's uh, it's not a done deal yet, but it's almost guaranteed. So, uh, that's good. I'm looking forward to that. Be something a little different. Uh, uh, get to uh, flex a couple of different muscles that uh, I haven't used in a while. So, I'm looking forward to it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Uh, let's see. So what is going on in the news? Well, one of the crazy ones is that um, that 70s show dude, uh, fucking, uh, what's his name? Danny Masterson. <laughs> getting uh, getting the fucking book thrown at him, going to fucking jail for 30 years for a supposed uh, couple of rapes that happened 20 years ago. Jesus Christ, man. How many times are these fucking bitches going to keep pulling this shit? When, when are people going to stop paying attention to it? You got no fucking proof. It's their word against his. But these fucking crazy-ass fucking courts, these liberal fucking courts, just side with the bitches right off the bat. And, uh, you know, it's a stacked deck against men. Uh, you know, it's... Pff, fuck, man. If you get accused of something, you might as well actually fucking do it at this point. You, you better have done it, because uh, even if you didn't do it, they're going to fucking say you did so you might as well just go ahead and fucking do it. <laughs> I wonder what that guy did, because I, I think he was a Scientologist. So he must have pissed somebody off somewhere, and they're, they're stitching him up. I mean, that's pretty fucking crazy that this dude, who's like, who, who the fuck even cares about him, uh, is getting fucking 30 years in fucking prison for something that is unsubstantiated. Nutso. Nutso. But, hey, that's the gynocentric fucking uh, society we live in now. Thanks, women. You fucking bitches. <laughs> Speaking of bitches, that uh, the fucking governor of fucking New Mexico suspending the uh, Second Amendment. Uh, <laughs> suspending your fucking constitutional right. Uh, and I knew somebody was going to pull this at some point in the name of a public health uh, safety issue, a public health issue. Fuck you. You know what the real fucking health issue is there in fucking New Mexico? It's all the goddamn illegals you let flood across the border into your fucking state. Maybe that should be considered a fucking public health issue. Right? I mean, that's, a, that's what's responsible for this fucking shooting. Uh, we, know, we all know it. You, you don't even have to ask who the suspect is, which they, they haven't even found yet. Suspicious. Haven't found the suspect, but we know what it is. We know what it is. It's insane. Open borders, just letting motherfuckers run roughshod, importing all these fucking third worlders into your fucking country. They come here, they fucking run amok. They don't give a fuck about anything. Man, it's insanity. When's it gonna stop? When's it gonna stop? <laughs> Nobody's gonna put their foot down. I mean, like, I can't believe there's not even, like, demonstrations going on in fucking New Mexico right now. Everybody's just rolling over and fucking taking it. Yeah, we're going to strip you of your constitutional rights, and uh, everybody's like, okay. I guess they're all too fucking drunk or fucking messed out there. I don't know what the fuck's going on. My cousin lives there in fucking New Mexico. She says it's a fucking shithole. I don't doubt it. I've only ever driven through there, never fucking stopped, never spent any time there. Don't fucking plan on it, especially now. Fuck that shit. God damn it. Well, see, this is what happens when you put fucking women in charge. No accountability, no fucking respect. Ugh. 
You gotta stop. You gotta stop. Men, you gotta put your fucking foot down. Americans, you gotta fucking put your foot down. Nothing's gonna get better unless somebody has the balls to stand up. You gotta fucking stand up. You gotta take one for the team. But that's not gonna happen. Not gonna fucking happen. So what else do we have going on? Really not a fucking whole lot of anything. Really fucking not. Sorry for the uh, the low interest here. The uh, the <laughs> it's <laughs> I just kind of don't give a shit right now. I don't give a fuck, man. I can't believe that we have fallen so far in just the last twenty years. I mean, like, the early 2000s seemed like we had a lot of fucking prospects. There was a lot of good things to look forward to. Um, even though we had Obama in the, uh, the late, uh, you know, 2000s, right before, uh, right before the, uh, the fucking housing market fucking collapsed in 2008, 2009. Even with him, I mean, things weren't totally fucking bad, but they were getting there. You know, he was setting up all the shit that was going to take effect afterwards. And, um... Man, it's just been fucking downhill ever since. The the only fucking light we had was fucking Trump. He came in and for a minute made things better. And boy, look at how they fucking stifled that. And look at what they're doing to that guy now. This system is so fucking corrupt. Uh, man, it's depressing. It's hard not to be fucking depressed right now. Damn it. What I wouldn't give to go back and be a fucking kid again. Shit having no fucking responsibilities. Man, I'd love to be fucking retarded. <laughs> I know. Some people are going to say, well, you are fucking retarded. You get wish granted. <laughs> no, but I mean, like, actually really fucking retarded. Uh, because then you wouldn't give a fuck and you'd have, like, you know, people fucking taking care of you. I remember one time I saw this fucking mongoloid uh, <laughs> in the land. And uh, I, was, I was going to get a fucking uh, pizza from fucking Papa John's back when Papa John's was still good and uh, not woke and uh, <laughs> yeah this this fucking uh, this fucking Porsche SUV pulls in and uh, I see these two uh, older people get out and out of the back seat pops this this fucking mongoloid I guess their son their their down syndrome son and the motherfucker is like uh, he's got this big ass fucking Rolex on his fucking wrist right <laughs> and he's fucking clapping because they're going in to get fucking pizza shit I'm envious of that dude I want to get driven around in a fucking Porsche SUV I want a fucking Rolex on my fucking wrist and I want to get fucking pizza and be happy about it man that motherfucker's got it made they got it made I should have been born a fucking mongoloid <laughs> what are you gonna do maybe in the next life Maybe I'll be blessed and I'll, I'll come back as a retard. <laughs> then I can live my life uh, fucking obliviously. Not have, to, not have to pay attention to all this aggravating shit. Anyway, I've rambled enough. Like I said, really not a whole lot going on right now. Uh, so we'll see what happens next week. Uh, I should have some good news about my career path. <laughs> and maybe something exciting will happen. Right now it's just fucking boring. Anyway, that's it for now. Puma fist out.